Hi, I'm Dave Epstein, and welcome to this edition of Growing Wisdom from South Natick, Massachusetts and Windy Low Nurseries. Today, we're going to be talking about the fiddle leaf fig. Here's a smaller fiddle leaf fig. There are larger ones, as a matter of fact. Take a look at this plant. This is about 12 feet tall and growing. It's a good thing it's in the greenhouse. For our first tip, we want to talk about light. Light is one of the most important things for all plants. The fiddle leaf fig likes a lot of direct light, but not a lot of direct sunlight. In other words, keep it somewhere where it's bright, but don't have the sun hit the leaves. Too much sun, the leaves will tend to get bleached, and too little sun, the plant will tend to drop its leaves. Our second tip has to do with water. You want to let the soil dry out a little bit between waterings. If you notice the very top leaves just starting to droop, that's an indication that the plant needs water. Over time, you'll begin to learn how much water your plant needs, as well as the interval between waterings. If you see the top leaves begin to droop, back off a day or two, and now you have your watering interval. Tip number three. The fiddle leaf fig tends to grow tall and skinny. In order to keep it more of a bushy tree-like structure, you want to do some pruning. As it gets to the height you like, begin to clip the top. That will force out some new branches. The fiddle leaf fig, like other ficus, doesn't like to be exposed to drafts, either of very warm or very cold conditions. It will cause the plant to lose leaves. Be careful where you place it. Over time, some dust will collect on the fiddle leaf fig. If it's summer, bring it outside and give it a good spray with a hose. If it's winter, you can actually put it in a shower and let the water trickle off the leaves. This will help the plant to absorb more light and more nutrients. You can move your fiddle leaf fig outside during the summer. However, remember, it doesn't want to be in direct sun. Keep it in a location where there's a little bit of morning sun, but a lot of afternoon shade. When you move it back in in the fall, do it slowly over time, and don't forget to bring it in before that first frost. Fiddle leaf figs can grow very fast and very tall, 40 or 50 feet. And since most of us don't have a house that's going to accommodate that type of plant, you want to prune the roots during the dormant season, when it's growing slower in the winter. To do that, lift the plant out of the pot, cut back some of the roots, put some new soil in, and place it back in the pot. This particular plant, the roots still have lots of room to grow. Those are our seven tips to keep your fiddle leaf fig really happy. Follow them, and the plant is sure to thrive in your home. For Growing Wisdom, I'm Dave Epstein.